So, first off, if you don't know what this tutorial look is, well, if you've seen, like, television shows and movies, they sometimes have the camera record thing. Like, it says the record at the top right, and it has, like, the white bars on the side. I'm going to show you how to make that. So, first off, you need to know um, what your camera recording settings are, like the format. So, to check that, if you go to, like, um, play your video, um, Windows Media Player, usually, but if you just click on it, it should say the format, but you should know the format since it's your camera. So, in Photoshop, you're going to File, New, and then you're going to change it to your settings that your camera records in. Mine 720 by 480 it's already there, so I'm just going to hit OK. You're going to make the color white. Change the color to white, and then using the Paint Bucket tool, fill it in. Once you do that, go to the Rectangular tool, and cut out a square. Simple enough. Okay. Once you do that, hit edit, copy, and hit control D to deselect. Now hit layer, new, layer. Hit OK. Now you can delete your layer one. Now hit um, edit, paste, and it should paste your square. And now you can even that out, mess around with it to make it like perfectly centered if you want. But I do recommend that. But since this is just a tutorial, it shouldn't matter for me. So, once you do that, make another one of those squares you just did. So, do that. You don't want it too thick, or else it's not really gonna look that well when um with your video. Like I made this a few times. I was messing around with it, and I made mine. Um, kind of thick, and it really, I was watching my video, it really didn't come out too well, so I'm going to just redo it along with this tutorial, because I wanted to make one for this, because I don't know if this is on YouTube, but I know some people probably wonder. Uh, that looks alright. Now I hit Control X, that deletes it. Try to make it even, so I think that's kind of even, it's alright, you know. Now, once you do that again, it's going down the center using the same tool. I've seen some videos on YouTube. Smosh, this is where I got this idea from a tutorial. Their video, Lizard Rabies, they have this as the lizard cam thing, so, yes. Now, just do the same thing across. Control X. Um. Now, after you do that, text. And hit, and using the color red, somewhere in red, right, record. It's actually too dark. So I'm going to change that lighter. Alright, now. That should be good. What the fuck? Rec. Stands for record, if you didn't know that. But I think you should. Move it up a little around here. That's good. Now, once, uh, if you notice, when your camera does record, if you have this certain kind of camera, there's like a circle right next to it. So, actually, first off, just export this. Alright, um, save it as record no dot. I'll get to that in a minute. And save it as... I'm doing PNG. Do whatever works for you. Um, hit 
get none right here. Now, once you do that, go to elliptical tool. Make a circle and then fill it in. Make sure you have a layer selected and fill it in red. So zoom in a little now. Zoom in around over here. And just uh hit control D to D select that. Now just actually control Z. Yeah, just go back. Just move it around to where you want it. Now, hit, now hit Control D. That'll deselect. But actually, I'm gonna move it down a little more. See how far it is. And that's pretty good. So now export this one as record with dot. Now it makes so, like somewhat sense. Okay, save it. And then hit OK. Now go into your editing software. I'm using Vegas Movie Studio 9. Uh, any software that has layers, like you can put layers, like layers on layers, you know what I mean? Like see how it's layered. Like it would be layer one here, and then above it would be layer two or whatever, something like that. Anything that has that, it'll work. Final Cut definitely has that. Um, all the movie studios and Sony Vegas stuff has that. So you should be good. And if you're doing this in like After Effects or something, uh, you really don't have to even use Photoshop. You could just make it in. Um, after effects like you can just go to the, like the layer new layer and then make it white and just cut it out in there with the mask tool and then just do something like that it would work in there but this is for people who don't have that so import your videos um, the pictures you just did but you're also going to need to import a video I'm just going to import one of my videos oh, this is pretty cool, but video of a boat I took my vacation. And then import the pictures of the record things you just did in Photoshop. Where is that? Oh, tutorial. And there. So now it looks like that look as if you're rec look as if you're recording with your camera. Now, if you notice when cameras record they do have like a flashing dot that goes on disappears comes back um so this is how you're gonna do that something I noticed I should have made the record red a little brighter that's okay here's this with no with dot. and now like make it the same size drag it you can see it looks like that. And a little bit more should be um should be shorter but so from here just um drag your clips as short or as long as you want them and then just swap back and forth with the one with no dot and with the one with the dot and then just like copy and paste that throughout the rest of your video until you want it and then that's just it so thanks for watching